Hi everyone! Today I prepared a St. Patrick's Day tutorial for you guys. So I'm starting off with no makeup on my face and applying a primer. This one's by Pixi. So I'm dotting it on all over my face and then blending that in with my fingers for a natural look. And then I'm going to be applying this NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Lime to my eyelids to prime them. And after that I'm going to be taking an eyeshadow. This one is from Coastal Scents in the color Nude. And then I'm taking that and applying it straight over top of that but only on the lid. And then I'm going to be smoothing that out with my brush. And then I'm taking Roll-On Shimmer from NYX and blending that out with my finger as well to give it that green look. Now I'm taking Khaki Craze by Maybelline and applying the darker green color to my crease. And then blending that in with the windshield wiping mode. Now I'm taking this Wet n Wild palette in I've been sunburned and I'm taking the gold color and applying this on my lower lash line. And then I'm going to be smoothing in the darker brown color onto the crease and outer corner as well. And then putting the gold just on the middle as a blending color. Now I'm taking my Revlon Color Stay Eyeliner and applying this to my waterline to give the eye look a little bit more definition. And then I'm taking this Master Duo Eyeliner by Maybelline, which is new that I just got, and I'm putting this on the top of my lid. This is really going to help your eyes look a lot bigger. Then I'm taking my eyelash curler, curling my lashes, and applying Colossal Volume Cat Eyes by Maybelline. And I'm just laying this on pretty thickly because I want my eyelashes to stand out. Then I'm taking my Tarte Glow Light, and this is really going to help like prime your under eye circles for concealer. And then I'm taking my favorite Sonia Kashuk palette in, in Agenda and applying this right over that, and it really does look flawless. Now I'm taking my Smashbox BB Cream and applying this all over my face, just like I did with the primer. I'm going to be blending it in with my fingers. And then taking Sunbeam by Benefit and applying this to the highlight areas, like above my cheekbones and my cupid's bow. And then blending that in with my fingers as well. This really does help give it a lot of shine to the look, and applying this to the bridge of the nose also creates a nice highlight. Now I'm taking my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Natural and buffing this all over my skin to set the highlight and the foundation BB cream. Also gives it a nice dewy finish. Now I'm taking my Chocolate Solo Bronzer from Too Faced, sucking in my cheekbones, and then contouring by putting it in the hollows of my cheekbones. As you can see here, I'm really blending it out so it doesn't look cakey or muddy. Now I'm taking this gorgeous blush by MAC in Peachy Keen. It's so perfect for springtime. And applying this to the apples of my cheek just to give it myself a subtle glow. And then I'm taking MAC's Sequin Lipstick and applying this to my lips and then blending it with my finger because I don't want the lips to be overpowering because the eyes are so dramatic. Now I'm taking a Bare Minerals lip gloss and applying it over the lipstick. That's the finished tutorial, you guys. I really hope you enjoyed this look. Thank you so much for watching.